Thanks. Breaking news update now. Shifting temperatures likely to blame for a water line break that left storm damage to a Tulsa gas station. Two news first on the scene today. Two news reporter Will Dupree joins us now. Begins our live team coverage with a look at the damage. Will. Well, Russ, uh, just a few moments ago, I talked to city leaders and they tell me that six businesses are affected by the water water line break here. Those six businesses are without water at this point, but I'm going to step out of the way and let you take a look and you can see where crews are working to repair that broken water line. And you can also see where the canopy fell onto the gas pumps back behind me here earlier today. This all happened after that water line broke and shot water high into the air for several minutes. Security cameras caught the moment when a water line broke in front of the to-go food mart in North Tulsa. At 8.55 a.m., you can see the sidewalk buckle and water start streaming out into the street. By 9.05, the water is spewing dozens of feet into the air. The pressure becomes so intense, it finally takes out the canopy over the gas pumps. My canopy is there, so I think of what's going on. I don't understand this happened. Like, I never think like happened like this. When the canopy came crashing down, the sound was so loud, one neighbor says it woke him up. Reminded me of the train wreck here a while back, there, the train wreck. That's how loud it was. The canopy was destroyed and half of it floating down the road and a big hole in the road and water was spraying everywhere. Another neighbor came to see what happened after talking to his son-in-law who works across the street. And when I got there, I was like, wow, it looked like a tornado hit it. It's powerful water to do that. <laughs> Real powerful. I mean, it looks bad. The city expects to have water restored by the morning, but it's going to take the gas station a lot longer than that to get everything back to normal. Well, the store here at the gas station will remain open for now, but the owner says he's unsure when he might be able to sell gas again. There's still a lot left to clean up tonight on 2 News at 6. An update on the timeline for the repairs. Live in North Tulsa, Will Dupree, 2 News Works for you.